Hello Bruins! So if you've ever wanted an item that we don't have in the library, you may have thought you were out of luck. But we actually have a service that allows you to borrow items from almost every library within the state of Michigan. Today's video on Melcat will tell you exactly how you can borrow books, DVDs, CDs, and more from Melcat. So Melcat is a service offered by the Michigan Electronic Library that connects KCC with over 400 libraries in the state of Michigan. It allows us to borrow books, DVDs, CDs from other libraries and have them delivered here to you. Or if you're a member of another Melcat library, we can have KCC materials delivered to that library instead. So to access this, one of the easy ways is to go just straight to the Melcat website. You can type in mel.org and that will take you to this page. The search Melcat box is right here and we will cover this in just a second. The other way directly from KCC, if you're in the library catalog, which we covered in a previous video if you want to check that out, at the top of the page you'll see this Mel link right there. If you click it this way, it will save whatever you were just searching for. So here I'm searching for bees. If I click that, it will take me to another search about bees, but this time through those over 400 libraries in the state of Michigan that participate in Melcat. Going back to the Mel homepage though, I'm gonna do that exact same search, bees. We're gonna get pretty much the same search results page we just saw. I just want to make the point to you that same features are there. It might look a little bit different depending on how you get here but everything is still the same. So like some other databases that we've already covered, there are ways to limit this if you need to. We can limit to a certain publication date, different subjects, um, if there's a format we want. For example, if we're only looking for DVDs, books, music recordings, all of those options are available to you. There will also be related searches recommended to you down here. So we see things like beekeeping, um, taxonomy, all of this stuff. Again, this is going to be related to whatever I just search for. Once I find a book I like the look of, I can click get this from Melcat. That will take me to this login page. If you're checking this out through KCC, you just want to select Kellogg Community College as your library and it will be delivered to the library once the process is all done. But like I mentioned before, if you're a member of, let's say, the Marshall District Library, um, you can have materials delivered there instead. It's the same exact service, it just changes where you're picking up the materials from. If you are using KCC as your library, you just want to log in here with your KID and password or your name and your KID. Doesn't matter which one you pick, just we have multiple options to make it easier easier for you. Pro tip, do not try to enter both, it does not like that, so just make sure you only enter one unlike me. And once you've logged in, you will see this page pop up. Most of the time you'll get this successful message, so it will let you know that it will be delivered to our checkout desk or that other library's checkout desk if you're doing it from another library. This process can take a few days, um, up to a week. Most of the time it's pretty fast though because it only has to be delivered in state. So this isn't a last minute solution, but if you are planning ahead or you just want something to read that we don't have, this option is always available for you. And as always, if you have any questions about Melcat or any library service, please feel free to contact the library, whether that's by phone, email coming in, or the chat service on our website that is available 24 seven. Thanks for watching and have a great day.